Yes, I do. Not my old job in the IT department, but my new job as your executive assistant, which you think I'm going to accept. Your thinking could not be more wrong in this matter. I need the girl Wednesday. It's Friday, and the answer is no. These computers have been upgraded. Far more processing power than your typical secretary. Did you know I went to MIT? Guess what I majored in. Hint, not the secretarial art. Felicity! We all need to have secret identities now. If I'm going to be Oliver Queen's CEO, then I can't very well travel down 18 floors every time you and I need to discuss how we spend our nights. And I love spending the night with you. Three, two, one. I worked very hard to get where I am, and it wasn't so I could fetch you coffee. Well, it could be worse. My secret identity is a black driver. Right now, I need you to figure out how the hijackers are getting a line on the goods earmarked for Glade's memorial. If we know how they're picking their targets, we'll know when and where to stop them. Fine. Oh, may I get you a cup of coffee? You're not actually offering to get me a cup of coffee, are you? Yeah, nope. That won't be happening, ever. Well, if you can bring yourself to do it, can you please make reservations for Dig, Carly, and I Saturday night at Table Salt? Sure. I'll get right on that, using the internet, which you also happen to have access to. <sighs> Dig. Is she breathing? Felicity. Yeah, yeah. But we have to get out of here. Yeah, I'm on it. Snapdragon. Password is Snapdragon. Password? Snapdragon. Armed guards, two pit bosses, and four men. You know, slot machines. I mean, how do you call yourself a casino without any lucky sevens? Stay focused, please. I'll be with you the entire time. Thanks. It feels really good having you inside me. And by you, I mean your voice. And by me, I mean my ear. I need to stop talking right now. That would be my preference. Hey, how was work? It is not work. It is a soul-crushing exercise in misery that offers health and dental. Suffice it to say, I am highly motivated to help convince the board to sell you back the company. Unfortunately, you don't really have the qualifications to run Queen Consolidated, but what you do have is passion. You care about the company and the people that work there. That's what you have to get across to them. You gotta speak from the heart. Felicity, would you like to go out to dinner with me? I'm being serious here, Oliver. So am I. I don't wanna read too much into this, but are you asking me out on a date? Like an actual date? Like a date? Date? Sure, I mean, the implication being with dinner that you... Usually I'm the one talking in sentence fragments. <laughs> Would you like to go to dinner with me? Yes. I'm sorry. Were you apologizing to me, or were you talking to your quiver? I didn't snap at my quiver. You kind of more than snapped. I know. And I'm sorry. I 
understand that this Mirakuru thing has you freaked out. And I have been in Central City a lot. Listen, it's, it's not that. When you are there, it just made me realize how much I need you here. You know, in the, be the beginning, I was just gonna, I was gonna do all of this just by myself. And now with you and Diggle, I rely on you. Well, does that mean I have a shot at Employee of the Month? No. Because you're not my employee. You're my partner. Pretty swanky offices. You can see all the destruction that your mom caused from up here. What do you want? World peace and personal satisfaction? Though not necessarily in that order. You poisoned me and put me in a hole. You have no idea how much I hated you for that. Turns out someone else hates you too. Who? <laughs> oh, you're going to be surprised when you find out. He's a man of means. Set me up with my new operation so I could draw you out. To do what? This! You're gonna have to try harder. Done! I'm threatening. Lower your bow. Your problem is with me. It's not with her. Well, then consider this your penalty for making me go to Plan B in the first place. <laughs> <laughs> Processing her now. I just wanted to check in on you. And you. I'm feeling better. And with the vertigo tainted vaccine, Queen Consolidated's Applied Sciences Division was able to formulate a non addictive treatment. Good. Need to meet my family at home, so you guys go home, get rest. Thank you. Yeah. And I'm sorry. For what? I got myself into trouble again, and you killed him. You killed again, and I am sorry that I was the one to put you in a position where you had to make that kind of choice. Felicity. He had you, and he was going to hurt you. There was no choice to make.
understand. Hi, Oliver Queen. I have an 11:30 with Tommy Rowan. I have a super deluxe, a big belly buster for a Mr. Andrews. I think he's in security. He could tip her. You can go on up, Mr. Queen. You can wait a second. You guy, you order food? Yeah, I'm addicted to Big Belly Burger. Never had it. I split it with you. Keep the change. Where are you heading, sweetie? 19th floor. Not too bad, I'm going to 13. Damn it! Mr. Andrews got his lunch? One belly buster with benzodiazepine. Pulled the mail. Stay tight. Mainframe zone 25, guys. This is as close as I can get you. I'm afraid of heights, which I just learned. Hey, Felicity, huh? hold on to me tight. I imagined you saying that under different circumstances. Very platonic circumstances. Ready? Uh huh. We need to talk. I don't want to talk. Which for me, I know is a little unprecedented. But as soon as we talk, it's over. I'm so sorry. I thought that I could be me and the arrow. But I can't. Not now. Maybe not ever. Then say never. Stop dangling maybes. Say it's never going to work out between us. Say you never loved me. It's say. Crazy. Ask me to say that I don't love you. I told you as soon as we talked, it would be over. So you're going to Nanda Parbat? No, it's a neutral site. It'll be fine. I'll come back. Theo will be okay. I wish that sounded more convincing. And I wish you wouldn't go, but I know you better, so I'm not going to ask you to stay. I appreciate that. But there is one thing I need to ask you to do. And you're not going to want to. Well, if it's you asking, I'll do it. Kill him. You have to kill Ross al Ghul. This is a duel, Oliver, with one of the most dangerous men that has ever walked the earth. And I wouldn't be doing it if I didn't think I could win. I don't doubt that. I don't doubt that you can beat him. I am terrified that you won't kill him. 
because that's not who you are anymore. And I am so afraid that Ra's al Ghul is going to use your humanity against you. Felicity, I honestly don't know if I'm a killer anymore. But I do know two things. The first is that whoever I am, I'm someone that will do whatever, whatever it takes to save my sister. And the second thing? I love you.